Hi everyone, this is the end of my YouTube channel. You don't need any more to follow my video tutorial. There is an incredible and powerful AI capability that will help you to create videos just with a description. Write a description and there is an agent in Microsoft 365 called Visual Creator that will generate taking from a source, which is a footage, high quality video footage catalog available in Clipchamp and will then give you a draft of a video, very well structured and almost ready to go. But don't worry, you have the ability to re-edit and change things if you don't like 100%. Okay, let me show you how you can create videos starting with a simple description. Let's go. Here I have Copilot open. In order to create a video using Copilot, all you have to do is open Visual Creator that you can see listed under Agents in the right panel. So now here, as a suggestion, I have three prompts. The first one will generate a video draft about how to engage your team at work. The second one, how to integrate diversity and inclusion in the workplace. And finally, the third one, why security is so important for a digital organization. But the one that I would like to create is this one. Create a video that explains all project management methodologies. Let me send this and let's see if Visual Creator can help me to have this. And here we go with the final result. A comprehensive video explaining various project management methodologies, including Agile, Scrum, Kanban. So I can click on this video and let's see in this way the final result. Project management methodologies are essential in guiding teams to achieve their project goals efficiently. In this video, We'll explore some of the most popular methodologies, including Agile, Scrum, Kanban, Waterfall, Lean, and Six Sigma. Each has its unique approach and benefits, making them suitable for different types of projects. Project management. It emphasizes collaboration, customer feedback, and small, rapid releases. Scrum is a subset of Agile, focusing on fixed length iterations called sprints. A scrum team works on a set of tasks within a sprint, aiming for incremental progress. Kanban, another agile methodology, uses visual boards to manage workflow and limit work in progress. It helps teams visualize and optimize their process. Waterfall, on the other hand, is a linear and sequential approach. It follows a strict order of phases, required. Cool, right? So this is just one video draft that I got starting with a description. And the good news is that you can re-edit the video if you want in Clipchamp. Maybe you want to have another text or you want to have a transition effect or you want to replace the existing audio with your voice. So it's very, very cool and easy to use. Now, where this video is dropped and stored. So if you want to reopen this video, all you need to do is click on the button open next to the title. This will drop you in Clipchamp immediately. So this means that you are able to edit this, this video in Clipchamp. So, but let's say that you want to see this video in OneDrive because this is the place where the video is saved on. So let's open a OneDrive now and let me show you where in which folder this, this video is stored. Here I have a OneDrive open now. Let me click on my files and under videos you are going to find Clipchamp. This is the place where every video generated across the agent visual creator will be stored. And this is the one that I created before. I have four elements inside. If I open the folder here, I can see the solution file that I can open with Clipchamp. And then I can see all assets used and the exports. This is for the moment empty, but as long as you are going to get started to work with Clipchamp, 
every item will be stored in these folders. Now let's go back to the previous experience and I want to open this video just created by clicking on the button Open. This will open a new tab in the browser with Clipchamp and the video just created. Now let's explore this, this video. As you can see, all assets, images, audios and all other video files are here stored. So this one, for example, is an image and here I have the audio. So and down below I have the balloon audio, the balloon sound, let's say. Then there are also text. So let me find some text because I found before a text that one is, for example, the text agile that appear in this, uh, in this exact moment, in this frame. So this is pretty cool. If there's something that it's not pertinent with the topic that you want to expand or discuss in the video, this is the way to go. So you can change any, any kind of thing available here. Here I have another text command, for example, I can, let's uh, focus on this moment. So if I double click here, I can change the text if I want. Every single piece that represent the asset of this video can be changed. And let's say that we are ready now, we are ready to export this video. All I need to do is click on export and here you can decide the, the detail of the quality that you want to have. Let's go with this one, for example, and then you can decide if store it immediately in the cloud. And this is the place where we have seen before the exports folder. Then I can click on it export and this will be exported exact in the exact folder that was described before. I can also share once this is exported with other colleagues in the company. Now that I meet my video is exported, I can share with my colleagues. Let's type just one, for example, my colleague Diego. And there we go. Now this video is shared with Diego. Now opening again OneDrive and if I open the folder exports here, I can find the file finalized and exported. Now I would like to cover another use case in the chat here. I'm going to paste this, create a video that explain how to summarize Microsoft Teams meetings with Copilot. I am still using Visual Creator and now there is the loading experience as you can see the Visual Creator is working on it and it's just a matter of seconds before my video, my draft is, is ready. Here we go, the video is ready to go. A video explanation how to summarize Microsoft Teams meetings using Copilot. Let's see the final result. Welcome to our tutorial on how to summarize Microsoft Teams meetings using Copilot. In today's fast-paced work environment, Keeping track of meeting details is crucial. Copilot can help you quickly. I'll post my video. It's very incredible the way how you can easily now draft videos using Visual Creator in Copilot. Okay, what do you think about this feature? Let me know in the comment down below. If you want to see more video like this one around Clipchamp and video editing in general, write Clipchamp or video and I will understand you. I hope to see you next time and don't forget to like and subscribe.